Guys, Ozzy Griffin here, and I'm doing a response to uh, the video on net neutrality by the Extra Credits crew. Love your series, by the way, guys. Um, and here's the thing. Australia has what's called the National Broadband Network. Now, this is an end run around that net neutrality argument, and I'm going to explain how it works. The National Broadband Network is a massive infrastructure uh, project and it's funded by government money. So you're probably thinking, hey, it's our money, it's uh, what we do with it. No. No. The National Broadband Network has two killers that take out net neutrality and really are going to reimpose a uh, economic class system on people who can use the internet. One. The, once the network goes to your, down your street and it's in front of your house, they're going to cut off the copper network in that area. So that means you can't get the old service uh, in parallel and you can't get their old guarantees. Ah, there was a whole bunch of little guarantees in there that as a government department they had to provide it because Australia is a commonwealth, ironically within a commonwealth. It's a long story. Second, the National Broadband Corp uh, the National Broadband Network is a corporate endeavour. It's government money being put into a corporate body. That's literally what a corporation means, a corpus, a body. That means they're a private company. That means they can make their packages of services and goods available to anyone at any price they like. That means they don't answer to the public like the government does. Ah, ha, ha. So... Ladies and gentlemen, I hope I have shown you how net neutrality can be circumvented when everybody wants infrastructure that's going to illuminate your wildest dreams and bring up the service level for everyone and is really going to give everyone uh, less service because you won't be able to afford it and you won't be able to afford it because it's a private company and we don't touch those. That's what the IMF said. So guys, I hope this has uh, given you uh, some nightmares or something to come and some inspiration to fight back. I'm Ozzy Griffin. You have a good afternoon.